Hey guys, I'm here to show you the, uh, the pickups in my Fender Nashville Telecaster. Um, and they are DiMarzio pickups. It's a Tone Zone T in the bridge, a Fast Track 1 in the middle, and an Air Norton S in the neck. Um, keep in mind, if you wanted to do this particular mod to your guitar, um, the neck pickup on this guitar is a Strat size neck pickup. So you have to have a pickguard that is routed for a Strat size neck pickup and not a Telecaster size. Telecaster neck pickup is, is generally a little smaller, so you have to have a special pickup or a pickguard made. So uh, it's a five-way switch, just like a strap. Um, and I also have push-pull pots in the tone and volume uh, for switching series and parallel on the uh, bridge and neck pickups. So I'm going to play through this full-on quick rod, uh, which I have a little zoom handy mic on. I'll play clean and then a couple of different dirty sounds so you can hear what the pickups sound like. And it's a really, really versatile guitar, and it's got lots of... Uh, lots of great tones that you can get out of it. So, anyway, uh, so I'll stop talking now. We'll play some, and then you can hear what it sounds like. Okay, I'm going to play through the uh, clean channel of the Splunk Quick Rod now, and uh, this is totally dry. There's no effects on it or anything. And um, so, one of the things that's great about these pickups is they have kind of a single coil tonality to them, but they're loud like humbuckers. So, if you like to switch between that kind of sound and then also a humbucker guitar, your clean channel. Is not going to get a huge drop in volume. It's not as noticeable. So that's a problem I've always had with playing strats and stuff. Is that when I try to switch to the clean channel, it just just disappears. So anyway, um, I'll show you all the pickups uh, as they are, and then I'll pull the pots to put them in parallel mode and let you hear that too. So here's the bridge pickup in full-on humbucking mode. Here's the two position, this is the bridge and the middle pickup. This is just the middle pickup. Here's the middle and the neck pickup. the neck. Okay, now what I'm going to show you is uh, the bridge pickup and the neck pickup. I have push-pull pots to switch between series and parallel. So what I'm going to do is put the bridge pickup in uh, parallel mode and then I'll put it back in humbucking mode so you can hear the difference. So here's the bridge in parallel humbucking mode, not in series. Alright, and then the pot's going to go down. Now we're in series mode. So you can hear there's, uh, there's an increase in volume and also mid-range, just overall fatness. Um, so it's a really great way to get um, a big humbucking sound out of the bridge, but also be able to get kind of more classic Telecaster sound. Um, so now I'll go to the, the neck pickup, and uh, we'll put it in parallel, and then we'll put it in series. So here's the neck pickup parallel. And here's a quick little thought. Um, when you go to the four position here, which would be the middle and the uh, neck pickup, uh, when it's in series mode, it's kind of fat sounding like this. But if I pull it up in parallel mode, it's a little thinner, more like a traditional strat sound. Alright, now we're on gear one um, of the Splawn, and this is a, it's kind of a, I mean it's a dirty sound, but it's not really, really dirty, it's like, sort of like a classic rock level of distortion. Um, so I'll play through all the pickups as they are, and then I will uh, pull both pots up and then play through all the pickups 
in the parallel mode so you can hear what that sounds like. So this is in standard series humbucking mode, starting with the bridge pickup. Okay, now I've pulled both the pots up, so the bridge pickup and the neck pickup are now in parallel mode, and I'll play through all the pickup sounds again, and you can hear it now it starts to sound more like a traditional Telecaster. over to gear two on the quick rod. Um, this is more of like a heavy rhythm sound, so there's more distortion, it's thicker sounding, and I'll play through all the pickups again on this side. I'm playing on uh, the same setting, but I've switched the pickups, the bridge, and the neck into parallel mode, and so it's a thinner sounding, more like a Telecaster, and we'll play it uh, that same sound. switched to Overdrive 2 on the amp, which is the same sound as before, but with more gain. Um, and I've turned on the delay, so there's a, there's a Boss DV3 uh, in the effects loop delay pedal. Um, so now I'm going to play some lead type sounds, and then I'll do the same things I did before. I'll go and switch them into parallel, and you can hear what that sounds like too. But we'll start in humbucking series mode. <laughs> Bye. 
here uh, on the particularly on the net pickup, the harmonic quality that these pickups have is is really impressive, especially to be, um, you know, the, just you don't you don't imagine that kind of sound. I think generally from a Telecaster guitar, um, but when you put these kind of hot rodded type pickups in it, you get all kinds of squeals and screams and all sorts of fun noise making. So anyway, now I'm going to put the guitar in uh, the parallel switching mode, and uh, so it's a bit more like a traditional Telecaster sound, um, but through that same game setting. So you can hear what this sounds like. sound clips um, and my monotone talking. So if you have any questions about the guitar, the wiring, the pickups, any of that, uh, feel free to just leave them in the comment section and I'll get back to you as quick as I can. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed it um, and uh, be sure to check these pickups out. They're great. Um, they sound really good. They give your guitar a lot of versatility and also a lot of uh, power that it might not have had before. Um, so uh, you know, if you like what you heard, check out my band, which I will put a link to right here somewhere. Um, also check out Swan Amplification. If you like the sound of the quick rod, great amps, and uh, catch you guys later.